most of our life, pretty much all of our life, we never know why Allah does what He does. We don't know. We don't know why you got into a car accident. We don't know. We don't know why you lost your job. We don't know why you got sick. We don't know why this problem happened or that problem happened. We don't know why your brother did so well in school and you failed. We don't know. We don't know why you're so short and your siblings are so tall. <laughs> and you start asking yourself, why, why did Allah do this? What's the, why can't He just tell me what He wants from me? Why doesn't He open, lift the curtain a little bit? So let me see what the secret was. What was the big plan? So I can just, if I just knew, well, maybe I'd be at ease. Because when you don't know, you know, when a, when a judge passes a verdict on you, the judge says, you have to pay this fine. And you say, why should I pay this fine? And he says, no, that, that knowledge is in the unseen. I'm not going to tell you. When a judge passes a verdict on you and you don't know why, then you become at unrest. You're like, I can't accept that. I need an explanation. I can't have that explanation be hidden from me. What Allah does in this story is He shows Musa alayhi salam there's always an explanation. But Allah decided, وَمَا كَانَ اللَّهُ لِيُطْلِعَكُمْ عَلَى الْغَيْبِ Allah has decided that He is not going to be informing you of what's happening in the unseen. Behind everything seen, there's something happening that is unseen and He has decided not to tell you. In this story, what Allah decided to do is He, you know, imagine there's a curtain and Allah lifted it, you know, through His teacher just a little bit so you can get a glimpse, a little bit, you can see what's happening behind the scenes. So you understand there's always something happening, but He doesn't lift it all the time. This is a special knowledge given to Khidr which is a special mercy to him.